Welcome to this edition of Burn Tech University, presented by Vogelzang. In today's video, we'll show you how to properly replace the glass gasket on the VG5790. Always refer to your owner's manual. This video is for informational purposes only. If you are unsure about replacing any of the components on this stove, we recommend having a stove technician or, when necessary, a certified electrician do this for you. The tools needed for today's project include approximately four feet of glass gasket, a number two Phillips screwdriver, flathead, or other scraping utensil, a nine thirty second socket driver, and approximately five feet of door gasket. Please make sure your stove is completely cooled before attempting to do any maintenance and or repairs to your stove. To start your project, you must first disconnect the power from the stove. Prior to removing the gasket, the left side panel will need to be opened. Now, open the two latches securing the door to the stove. Be sure to wear your gloves to protect your hands as this gasket contains fiberglass. Remove the old gasket by pulling it loose from the stove. Next, scrape the excess sealant from the door of the stove. Remove as much leftover sealant as possible. Using your socket driver, loosen and remove the six nuts securing the retaining bracket to the glass. Both the glass and retaining bracket can now be removed from the stove. Then, carefully remove the glass from the bracket. Now, remove the gasket from the glass. Next, Grab your new glass gasket. Carefully separate the white backing from the sticky surface attached to the back. It will be easier if you partially separate this and just get it started. To add the new gasket to your glass, simply adhere the gasket to the bottom center of the glass and wrap the excess around the edges. When you've covered all the window you need, cut the rest of your gasket with wire cutters. Once you've finished applying the gasket onto the glass, place the glass into the retaining bracket, then attach the glass and bracket onto the back of the door and line the holes up. Then insert and tighten the nuts. Now, squeeze the sealant around the groove on the door of the stove. Now, 
Then, press the new door gasket into the groove. You will need to start your gasket at the bottom center of the door. Depending on the length, you may need to trim the gasket using wire cutters. You must close the door to help hold the gasket into place until the sealant is completely dry, which will take approximately 24 hours. Within the drying period, the stove will not be operational. Now that your project is complete, you may reconnect power to your unit and check for proper operation. Once again, this video is for informational purposes only. We strongly recommend a stove technician or, when necessary, a certified electrician do any repairs for you. If you need further assistance or have any questions, Please visit us at vogelzang.com or give us a call at 1-800-222-6950. Thank you for watching this edition of Burn Tech University.